Welcome to Time to Play. Watch out! Man, you don't hit somebody when they're trying to make their introduction. It's messed up, man. No, shoot this way, you idiot. Anyways, I was saying, welcome to Time to Play The Legend of Zelda Part 8. This is Ron Moore, and I am now in the 8th dungeon. The Lion Dungeon. If you say this dungeon's easy, you be lying. I fail. Okay, I gotta fight this blue enemy giant crab again. He got pwned pretty quickly. And in this dungeon, I gotta get two items. I'm about to get the first one here real quick. And this dungeon is hardcore. You got dark nuts everywhere. The, the, the little circle thing. That freaking stop you from using your sword momentarily. And yeah, so this dungeon is going to be tough. Oh, thank God. I got the clock right off hand. Skip Rogers will have you believe that the fourth dungeon is tough. But he is wrong. The eighth dungeon is. Alright, I disposed of all them. Now let's go down here. Get the first item in this dungeon. Now I got the book of ECW. The book of ECW enables my magic wand to shoot fire. Or not shoot fire, but whenever it hits something, it catches something on fire. So I, I can now use that to light up the dungeon when it gets dark instead of those candles. Alright. Jeez, again! Alright. Bombs away. Oh, nope. Yes. Oh, jeez. Oh, this is great. Thanks a lot, Nintendo. The four things in the corner are shooting fireballs at, or whatever balls at me, and plus the blue dark nuts for crying out loud. Now I told you this dungeon is hardcore. Man, jeez. Dang it, freaking blocking my sword attacks. Get the fairy. Alright. Very good. Alright, yes. Stick and move, stick and move. Ow! There we go. Get the heck out of here. Should call this the Dark Nut Dungeon. Jeez. I wonder why they call them Dark Nuts instead of Dark Knight. I guess it's, that's be too cliche. More to go. Jeez, come here. All right. I'm not sure. I think I'll go up here. I don't even have the map yet. Oh man. Yeah, this dungeon is a lot of fun. Come on, let's go. Alright, finally, let's get out of here. Ugh. And you can't attack the Dark Nuts with the wand. They're impervious to it. Oh, 
already maxed out on bombs, so that don't matter, but let's go in here. Get to the other side of the dungeon, or wherever it's gonna take me. I still don't have the map accomplished yet, so I already don't know where to go, because I don't, I don't know this dungeon by memory. Dang it, man. These freaking rabbits, wherever they are. It's rabbit season. More like ECW season. Alright, let's cut through that. And Robin, I kill the last one, I get the clock. Thanks. Time is of the essence. Oh, man. Oh, at least it's not blue. Let's just skip through that. I don't want to fight all of them. Okay, I think that's a clue for another bomb upgrade. I think he gets 16 at the most in this game. Right. Whoa, I'm at the bo the boss already. Gleok, I think is his boss's name. This time, four heads. I haven't even got the map or compass yet. How the heck? Oh man, I can't beat this dungeon yet. I don't have the the other item. Well, let me get the Triforce here, then re-enter the dungeon and start again so I can get the other item, because I'm, man. Yeah, because I, I don't know where to go here. I'm going to have to really find the map or something. I guess I should listen to Skip Rogers more often. Another key. As if I don't have enough already. Jeez, I got six. Oh, get the clock, get the clock. Jeez, watch out, man. Oh, look at the clock. Oh, I wasn't say that's useless, but it's not. They'll freaking stand still. Shut up. Pwn the bat. Alright. Oh, come on. Ah, uh, I want to bomb down there for there's no more space on the on the map. You can't see the map, but obviously you can't go any further down. Well, this is gonna be a lot of fun watching me get through this, I'm trying to figure it out. Dang, I wish you kill those rabbits wherever they are with the with the wand, but you can't. I don't know what I'm doing here as far as how to get that last last item at least have the compass here but that's useless because I mean I'm not gonna need it <laughs> I already beat the boss it doesn't tell me where the item is geez so many dark nuts here the game's lagging and these ball these Balls coming after me too. All right, nice. Not nice. Oh wait. Well, nice. I'll just go through here. I don't want to fight them. Oh, okay. Gama's back this time. He's gonna take three arrows. Ah, jeez. Come on, Goma. Look me in the eye. Ha. That's one. 
too. Ah. Oh, come on. I got him. Or her, whatever it is, Queen Goma. Nice. And that is the clue to get to Ganon's Tower, or Dungeon, whatever it's called. And of course, that was a waste of time and a waste of bombs. Alright, what to do next? There's another key. Nice. Oh, nice. A key and bombs. Now watch me waste them here. Jeez, let me light this room. I can't even see where I'm going. Of course, I wasted them. You know, they say don't spin it all in one place. Well, I just did. Like a complete idiot. Alright. Ah, jeez, not in here again. Shut up. All right, let's cut through all that, and I finally found where I need to be, thank God. Gotta kill these enemies real quick, and then go down the stairs and get the second item. I like to be slick. At least he's an easy target. All right, down we go. And there's the second item in Dungeon 8, the ECW key. And that key will enable me to open up any locked door in any dungeon. Of course, the only dungeon I need to go to next is the final dungeon, Ganon's Dungeon. And we will see that in the final part. Until then, God bless and take care.